Hi and welcome, Stefan here. Uh, we've been uh, out here camping for a couple of days in this uh, magnificent uh, Girraween uh, National Park in Queensland. It's about 9 o'clock in the morning, uh, about 24 degrees. And I thought I would take this opportunity uh, to uh, demonstrate uh, this 150 watt uh, folding solar cell. We've been using it here in the last couple of days uh, to charge the auxiliary battery in, in the car which is powering a 60, 60 litre uh, fridge in the back of the car. As you can see, these cells um, fold up into this very neat small package and weighing about five kilos. The uh, solar panels have this Anderson plug uh, built in uh, and this plug is used uh, almost universally in the camping uh, environment in Australia to connect up uh, solar cells to um, solar charges which are typically located either in a camper trailer or they can be in the car, in, in our case it's under the bonnet, uh, or they can be just separate standalone uh, charges. So why don't we uh, just pop over and lay this out in the full sun uh, so you can get an idea of how it works. So all we need to do is just simply put them on the ground, roll it out and then fold it out. And there it is. Let's lay that in the full sun uh, and it's, it's ready to go. Then we simply connect up our Anderson lead uh, and plug it into the cell uh, like that and it's ready to go. Okay, so to uh, pack this uh, panel away is just the reverse of uh, unfurling it. So we need to disconnect the Anderson plug. Just remember to hold both Anderson plugs when you do uh, pull them apart so that you're minimising any stress or strain on the, uh, on the connection. And then all we need to do is just simply fold it back the way we unfold, filled it. So we just simply fold it over end on end like this. And there we are. A minute really to, uh, to uh, put this out and uh, put it back in. Let's, uh, let's go over to the uh, car now and have a look and see how much power we're generating. We're over by the car now. We have the solar panel out in the sun and the other end of the uh, Anderson lead is going into uh, the charge controller, which in this case is located under the bonnet of the car. It's a red arc uh, charge controller that has a solar uh, MPPT controller built into it. That then manages the power into the auxiliary battery of this car, which is in this case being used to uh, run fridges and um, uh, charge phones, etc., and run lights if you wish. Let's have a look and uh, see uh, how much power we're generating. Uh, in this case, it's uh, about 120 watts, around 8.5 amps, going into the uh, solar controller, which would then be uh, charging the battery appropriately. That's actually a pretty impressive. Um, amount of uh, solar energy uh, being, being uh, generated, uh, particularly given that um, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's mid-morning um, and uh, the cells are rated at 150 watts, so that's actually pretty nice. They're really great performers, these cells. Well, thanks for watching and enjoy your uh, camping. Thanks.